Tonight, tomorrow, we celebrate the Feast of Holy Family. The Feast of the Holy Family occurs on immediate Sunday right after Christmas. And as we know, families are precious. Families are fragile. Families can be broken. And broken families can be mended. But sometimes it is difficult to mend broken families. When it comes to dealing with families and perhaps to extend that to friends, there are always two things that we should remember, two key principles on how we want to treat and love those in our families. And these are the two principles. Appreciate what you have. Love what you had. That is extremely important. Appreciate all the family members that you have right now in your family. You know, there's a tendency every so often not to love certain family members as much as you should and to love them more after they're gone. Because sometimes family members, certain family members, we're all different, we're all human beings. Sometimes they do little things that aggravate you, agitate you. Maybe it's the way they handle their soup, the noise they make. Maybe it's the noise they make during the night as they sleep. Maybe it's just the way that they are that you just find aggravating. It just aggravates me, drives me crazy. But when something happens to that person, what is one of the first things you wish you had back? All those things that aggravated you. I would give anything for my husband to be back, back and making noise when he has his soup. All that racket as he's bringing the spoon to his mouth. Why does he have to do that? But we want those things back. Sometimes we only appreciate what we have after it's gone rather than while we have it. And that's kind of unfortunate. We're going to watch a little video that shows us just how precious, how important family members are. And when, when they're gone, sometimes our life is never really the same. Let's watch. As our delight reside in things, or are the feelings in our hearts the real gift that Christmas brings? The message on this Feast of Holy Family is, is pretty simple. It's right there. Appreciate what you have. Love what you had. Well, families are precious. Never forget that. Families are fragile. Watch how you handle your family. Be careful. Don't be abusive in words. Don't be abusive in actions. Families can be broken. Perhaps you've experienced that already. 
And broken families can sometimes be mended. Sometimes it takes that act of humility. Someone has to put their tail between their legs and say those words, I made a mistake, I'm, I'm sorry. But some people find it very difficult to say I'm sorry. And so the broken family remains broken. The splintered heart remains splintered. On this night of the Feast of Holy Family, and tomorrow as well, always remember that. It's extremely important. Appreciate what you have and your family members. Well, you might sit back and say, well, this one or that one isn't the way I wanted them to be, or they have this flaw, or that flaw. The truth of the matter is, I think we all have flaws. Just have to love what you have. And to love what you had. I see that fellow there, and I see him gazing out the window, and he's missing his wife. And when he got that scarf, that just gave him a connection to her. That scarf had to make him feel so good. I take it in my life, or in my looking at that fellow, he will never lose that scarf. The day he loses that scarf, and it won't be out, out of a careless act, just somehow the day he loses the scarf, he will then that day lose his wife. Remember those two phrases because they're extremely important in our lives. Appreciate what you have and love what you had.